Today we are going to give you an overview of an RJ45 connection. We are using the GUE7071W, which is our RJ45 Euro module. This rule applies to all modules or plates we offer in this range with the RJ45s. You must adhere to the following standards before you do so. It would be T568A or T568B. You must look at the connections on your existing cable, then follow the colour code to where you need to terminate the cables to. We recommend using an IDC punch tool or equivalent, cable cutters to strip and cut the wire. A cable tester is a brilliant product to test the connection after you've made the termination of the cable. We do not sell these products, but they are available from any local DIY store. Prepping your cable is important, making sure the cable length is long enough to terminate the connection. Various methods may apply, but here's a general rule. Here is a quick overview of the termination. Thread the cable through the loop and bring the cables into the correct terminal. On the right scheme you have chosen, use the IDC punch tool to cut the excess cable off and make a connection. You will hear a click once it's secured. Once the cable has been terminated correctly, you'll be able to pull the cable tie. Remember, you've either followed A or B. This test picture follows T568B. Once you've done so, we will get on to just an overview of the cable testing itself. You can pick up a cable tester from any DIY store. You would just plug the two connections into the cable tester, press the button, and this will test the connection if it's accurate. They should follow simultaneously side by side, giving you an indication. Um, thank you for watching this FAQ video. Thank you.